Hello and welcome to Grantham Caravans. My name is Brian, I'm part of the sales team here at Grantham. You can contact us on 01476 560 599. So I'm just about to take you on a short walk round tour of a Coachman Acadia 575 2021. We don't have a display model for this particular van on site because we have to be selective about what we choose as our display models. But this caravan's just about to go in for its PDI uh, prep and be prepared for a customer to collect and dispatch. So here is a good look at that particular caravan. So a new logo for Coachman in 2021 that you see at the front there. Two side locker boxes, uh, left hand side for the step, electric hookup cable and various other items to be cautious and conscious of nose weight. Uh, two 6kg gas bottles comfortably fitting in the right hand side. 2021 Acadias also coming as standard now with the Alco ATC trailer control, making for a SAR far safer and secure tow. On the side of the caravan, we've got an exterior 240 volt socket, an exterior bar bar barbecue point, and also a wet locker box. You've got the Acadia logo that you see on the side of the caravan there. And also with it being a transverse island bed, you've got the rear access hatch to underneath the bed. So stepping inside the caravan, the first thing you notice is a very generous sized kitchen work surface. You've got three gas hob, burner with one electric in a combination oven and grill with pan storage underneath. Ample amount of storage located under the sink area and tucked away here is the freestanding table for the front of the caravan. The Acadia fabric scheme, you get a first good look at the fabric scheme that you see here. PIR sensor for the alarm located down the front right hand side. The great thing about having those two side locker boxes is the fact that the chest area has been recessed back, creating a far better usable and larger living and lounge space. Short pull out chest in the front there as well with pull out, uh, pull out table and plenty of storage with the drawers that you see underneath. You have the panoramic sunroof at the front, letting a huge amount of light into the caravan, coupled with a medium sized hecky light. You've got the wonderful curved locker effect that you see in these lockers and that two-tone wood effect. Aldi wet central heating and the coach and command panel located above the habitation door. Television point located just above this side binnacle and you've also got a 240 volt socket down the front and in the kitchen area so plenty of power points. The new Dometic fridge that they're using in the 2021 models that you see located under here. Easy usable height microwave. As we step through to the bedroom area. So a generous spaced wardrobe with hanging rail, the Alda wet central heated header tank there, as you can see with the pink liquid in it. So the five year liquid going straight in at production stage now. Matching headboard with the curved wood locker effect going through to the bedroom area. And first look at the transverse island bed. So this is the bed in the down sort of sleeping position. And just to give you a bit of an example, then as to far as to moving it into the day position to real give, give you a real good feeling of space. So that then is the bed easily popped up into the day position. You've got a comfortable move round the end of the bed. You've also got second television point there with 240 volt socket. A nice shelf running along here for storing various bits and bobs with a second wardrobe to the other side of the bed. High quality of chrome finish on the bathroom door with the catch that just keeps that in place whilst traveling. An extremely generous sized individual shower cubicle. High quality of finish on the sink and generous and large vanity mirror with mood lighting dotted above. Storage underneath and also an Aldi wet central heated towel rail with further storage above the Thetford toilet. So that gives you a real good feel, a good understanding for what the Acadia 575 2021 has to offer. If you have any queries or questions, please feel free to contact us. I hope you've enjoyed the walk around tour and I hope we can do business together. Thanks very much. Bye bye now.